More details on the way. Uh, but currently talking to uh, the lovely Christopher and Hilary, who are the children of the creator of Thomas the Tank Engine. Um, and I asked them at what point did they realise that Thomas had become so huge? I think the first point at which I realised there was the, the stories were sort of beginning to take off perhaps was when when the fourth book came out, Tank Engine Thomas Again. I was sent a copy. I was at boarding school at the time. I was sent a copy and inevitably showed it around among my mates. They sort of said, cool, Audrey's father writes stories. <laughs> and, you know, that was a nine-day wonder. I think they forgot about it after that. I think that was the point at which I realised that, um, you know, th this this was something something quite important mm. um, and not I had no inkling obviously that uh, we would all be here 65 years later but um, uh, an, an inkling that, that this was a little bit more than just an ordinary story You went on to write some stories with your father as well didn't you Christopher? Yes I did, yes that, that was much later though And so is, this very, is Thomas still very much a, a big part of both of your lives? Yes, oh yes, he, he has to be, um, I think, really, one way or another. My wife and I used to go around to many railways, uh, spreading the word. We, we're getting older now, and we don't do that anything like so much, but um, we you know, try and help where we can. Uh, tell us about this um, rare artwork that's being published. Um, well, this has just recently been discovered, although it's been around for all this time. It's usually locked away in a vault somewhere, but they're really beautiful. Um, it's, it's Dad's original artwork when he was trying to show the artist how he wanted a picture to look and what a particular engine with its wheel structure should look like. Mm. And there is um, something that I've seen for the first time today, an actual handwritten Edward the Blue Engine in a little booklet with Dad's own pictures and um, I'm really it's a wow factor. For you it's is marvelous. it really? Oh, yes it's wonderful. the first time I've ever seen it. Have you got Thomas's you know little um, models of Thomas's around your own homes? Oh gosh I've got a massive collection <laughs> of <really>? Thomas. <laughs> It hits you as you come so in I was going to say, door. if I walked into your house, would would I know that you had something to do with with <laughs> Thomas the Tank you Engine? Would. <laughs> <laughs> it's in every room. Christopher, what about you? Well, yes, we, we they don't um, quite spread around as they do as as much as they do in Hillary's house, but um, we have a room given over to uh, boxes and books. We, we, our collection mainly features around books. Right. Um, but uh, there are other things as well, yes. Well, a it's wa full. wonderful what your dad's done and great that you're both um, continuing to uh, promote Thomas. Thank you very much for coming on the show. You're Thank welcome. you. Thank you. Thank you very much to uh, Christopher Audrey and uh, his sister Hilary Fortnum. And Thomas the Tang Engine is out now. Uh, it's 14 99 and you get it, get it from all good bookstops.